We move to gasoline prices and a big surprise from the White House today. The president decided to use some 30 million barrels of oil from the U.S. emergency supply, the strategic reserve. As soon as he did, oil prices tumbled, $4 a barrel today. So why did he do it now and what does it mean for gasoline prices? ABC's Bianca Goladriga, who's worked on Wall Street and reports on dollars and cents, is here. So why now d does he know something we don't know? Well, Diane, the key headline here is that he didn't go this alone. This is a coordinated effort with 27 other countries in total to tap into 60 million barrels of oil. 30 million from the U.S., 30 million from 27 other countries. This is a big deal because this is only the third time we've seen this happen. Now, one issue, one reason we're doing this, supply disruptions in Libya. We do know that. But the bigger underlying issue is that there's growing concern that the overall economy is continuing to slow because of high oil prices. If you need any more proof, take a look at this chart. We have a chart of gas prices over the past year, and they continue to climb, and we know that this is really hitting consumers hard. So the economy can't recover as long as people are paying so much for gasoline. How quickly will we see it at the pump and how much? It is possible we could see gas prices go down anywhere between 8 to 12 cents a gallon. Now the traditional rule of thumb is that for every one dollar drop in a gallon of oil we can see gasoline drop anywhere between two to three cents. So over the next few days we could see some relief but if you compare this to even last year consumers are going to be paying more for gas this year. But over the next few days this could happen. This Soon. is a good relief. Yes we could see relief. Okay Bianca thank you.